Hello, my name is Heather Falconer and I'll be presenting on the trench coat trend. Trench coats are a closet staple for all genders and people of all ages, but they weren't always. They originate back to the 1820s and still appear in the most recent fashion shows today. Trench coats are a versatile and timeless trend. So there are three key people in the trench coat's history who helped turn it from a military necessity to a fashion accessory. First is Charles McIntosh, whose design was a military necessity. And then John Emery, whose design was for well-dressed men. And then there's Thomas Burberry, whose design was waterproof and breathable and is very versatile for both men and women. So to the left shows the trench coat's original purpose, which was just to help protect men in the military in World War I. And then on the right shows the trench coats now, and they're definitely more of a fashion accessory to show off your status or to try and fit in with a chic look. Because the trench coat has been around for so long, it's very accessible to most of the population. There's such a wide range of prices that they can be found at. Um, because of this, I believe that it falls in the fashion acceptance stage. Numerous retailers sell trench coats and they're literally everywhere. For the target market of trench coats, they're mostly worn in America in cities by young women in their 20s and businessmen who are white in middle to upper class and educated and less religious. They're worn by those who want to portray a chic and sophisticated look and want to fit into the look of high status and social class and urban lifestyle, and they are stylish. So these pictures show the audience of trench coats. You can see a young woman, she's wearing the trench coat with jeans and heels. It shows its versatility. There's a, a businessman in a suit wearing a trench coat over, holding his work bag. And then there's Meghan Markle and her husband, and this just shows how people of high status wear trench coats. In terms of which theory applies to the trend of trench coats, I believe that it's the downward flow th theory because celebrities wear trench coats and we see this on social media and it makes us want to wear them too. Um, additionally, trench coats became popular by a very expensive designer, meaning those of the upper class had more opportunity to first take on the trend. As I discussed previously, this trend has recurred multiple times. They were first very popular during World War I times in the military for use in trenches and have gone through the fashion cycle ever since. In the 19th century, they were used more as rain jackets and are now used as a fashion staple. Modern trench coats are made out of different material like leather and vegan leather and have since adopted numerous colors and patterns. In order for this trend to become popular, there were numerous fashion leaders who influenced it. There were celebrities and fashion icons like Blake Lively, Kit Keenan, Marlene Dietrich, Cole Sprouse, Cara Delevingne, Kate Moss, Jennifer Lawrence, Emma Stone, and Meghan Markle. Above, they can be pictured wearing the trench coat. There are also numerous social media influencers who use their platform to rant and rave about how much they love the trench coat trend. These are influencers like Hannah Maloche, Amy Song, Negan Mirsa Lehi, and Zoe Sugg. They can be pictured above wearing their trench coats. There are also fashion bloggers who write about how much they love the trench coat trend. These are bloggers like Tina Adams, Amy Jackson, She Wears Fashion, and Jessica Wang, and they're pictured above in their trench coats. And then there's Fashion Insider articles like Complete Guide to the Trench Coat by Fashion Beans and 14 Reasons Why You Should Be Wearing a Trench Coat Right Now by Vogue. So the designer who first made this trend popular was Burberry, and this is by Thomas Burberry. His company first started off as just a menswear business and has since evolved to include numerous female styles. Um, the trench coat trend was present on the runway multiple times in spring 2022, and you will see this on the next slide. So here you can see the numerous variations of the trench coat that were on the runway for spring 2022. You can also see the numerous designers like Burberry, Michael Kors, Fendi, Loire, who decided to include a version of the trench coat in their spring 2022 collection. In terms of the competitive retail landscape, the trench coat is kind of all over. In terms of fashion leadership position, it's part of various from fashion leaders to mass merchants. And for the merchandise and store format, it's various too, from general merchandise retailers like Macy's to specialty retailers like Zara to designer boutiques like Burberry. So as you can see here in these pictures, there's so many variations of the trench coat. Um, some are oversized, short, sleeveless, quilted, lined and unlined, denim, wool, khaki, 
belt lists, ones with concealed fastenings, and there's so many more. In terms of the prices that you'll find trench coats at, of course that's going to depend on quality. Um, prices at the designer level are very high and they're above like $1,500. Prices at the general merchandise level are more reasonable at about $50 to $100 and then prices at the budget level are around $15. So in this picture, it's showing a trench coat at the designer level from Burberry. As you can see, it's pretty basic looking. It's tan, it has the normal length and the buttons. Um, it's priced at $2,250, so as you can see, that's very high. And this picture is showing a trench coat at the general merchandise level from Macy's. This one seems to be oversized and maybe a little longer than normal. Um, it's priced at $60 on sale, so that's pretty reasonable, and it, it, I think it would have a pretty good quality. It's from Macy's. So this trench coat is priced more at a budget level. It's close to $30. It has a more unique look to it, though. It has a pleated back to it, um, but I would say that this would definitely be more of an accessory rather than a coat because the quality will probably be much lower than the other variations that I showed. So I recommend that my company continues to invest in this trend and I think they should invest heavily. Because of the amount of time trench coats have been around and because they remain widely accepted, I don't foresee them going anywhere anytime soon. They're very present in the spring 2022 runways and I don't think they'll ever really go out of style. Lastly, these are just all the sources I use to find my information. And thank you so much for listening to my presentation on trench coats.